What's up, GQ? This is Levante David, linebacker of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, and these are my essentials. Everybody needs their cell phone. When I uh, open it up, there's a picture of my mom and dad. I lost both of my parents, so, you know, for me to uh, see them every time I wake up in the morning and look at this phone, you know, it gave me a little inspiration in the morning. I was blessed to be raised in a two-parent household. Uh, my mom and dad, you know, played a huge part of my life. Well, my dad kind of played the, the stay-at-home dad role. He the one who got me involved in, you know, sports and football and things like that. You know, he was a basketball player growing up. You know, my mom, <laughs> you know, she was a, a football fan a little bit. She didn't really, you know, take heed to me playing football because of, I guess, the, you know, the violent part of it. I don't think she thought I was really good until she actually came to see me play, so that's when she really started getting involved, getting more involved, getting more hands-on with it, and, uh, you know, she's uh, definitely one of my biggest fans. The watch that I have on is the Hublot Classic Fusion. This watch is, like, one of my first big purchases basically matches with everything you know if I want to just go out and just throw some you know look nice and just throw on the watch this is the watch that I put on you know I wear it all the time got a little watch collection uh, picking up a little bit I got my watch on my left wrist on my right wrist I got a couple bands the first band that I want to talk about is this Zuku band basically a brand my uh, friend of mine close friend of mine started you know back home a guy who I grew up with since we were kids and the Zuku brand was something that, you know, he kind of took and ran with it with, uh, you know, trying to start a clothing line, and then that's what just what we call ourselves. I wear it to, you know, basically like just represent, you know, us, our little childhood group. This other band is called, uh, it's Humble Over Hype. You know, I just thought it, uh, it just resonated with me. Just being humble got me to this position right now. I feel like humble is always, being humble always, you know, gets you to where you need to be. Just being thankful and just being grateful for, you know, all the travel tri tribulations you may have. My toiletry bag, as you can see, it's a Goyard toiletry bag uh, with my initials LD and my number on it, 54. Basically, a Christmas gift to myself. Obviously, I keep a lot of, you know, a lot of things in here. I got my deodorant, my toothbrush, my lotion. I mean, being down here, there ain't really no need for lotion because it's so hot. You know, I gotta uh, actually gift this bag to my teammates, the whole defense, for Christmas. And I was like, you know, why not get one for myself? I remember guys used to pick on me because my old toiletry bag was non-name brand, it was it was trash, but I thought it was always useful, but like, since I got new one, I said, I mean, I'm in my way just give myself an upgrade, so this toiletry bag is a uh, central of mine. Uh, I really like it, I'm glad I purchased it. <laughs> Listerine, cool mint mouthwash, always gotta keep this on deck. I mean, I know a lot of people uh, had that moment where, you know, you out and, you know, some somebody tell you, do you ask you, do you need a gum? You like, Is my breath stink or something? You know, you get offended at first, you know, you may be rushing, you may forget. So I keep my wash in the car, you know, pop some in just in case, make sure I'm straight, go from there. You know what I'm saying? So hygiene is very important for me. These are not a fancy pair of sunglasses. These are some Nike sunglasses that I got off Nike Elite, basically for free and they do everything every other sunglasses do, so I, I, got, I got to keep these on deck. Living in Florida, it'd be so bright outside. Make sure I have the sunglasses on deck so I don't mess up my eyesight. And I think sunglasses look good on me anyway, so. My Bose headphones, these things right here, I love them because of noise cancellation. It's really good, especially for the plane, for sure. I get kind of nervous on the plane, so I just put these on to kind of tune me out, and I put my tunes on, and I'll be, I'll be good. These was free, so I'm definitely going to put them to use. When I'm working out, you know, obviously it's the more, you know, hip hop, more hip hop working out. And then when I'm on the plane, it's more common music, R&B, gospel. My favorite uh, radio on Pandora is uh, Luther Vandross and then Tasha Cobb Leonard. You know, so I listen to those to kind of calm me down when I'm on the plane ride. And then our linebacker position room, you know, we had a, gr a group of guys that have waves and stuff like that. So we always have a little competition. I always keep this around, man. I wear this, you know, around the house. You know, I'm just making a quick run somewhere. Got to keep this on. And then uh, obviously, got to keep the brush on deck, the soft side and the uh, hard side. After you finish getting the haircut, you got to get your hair brush, kind of get the way it's going, get them shine a little bit. Because I fell off, I'm going to give it to probably KJ Britt and Devin White. They kind of battling. You know, they got they got a nice little wave game up. For the little stuff that I got, I do the basic stuff. So I'm doing pretty good. I feel like I'm doing better than them just because of the small stuff that I do to get my wave. Now right here, I got my cologne, my bond number nine. Gotta have cologne as a man. I feel like, you know, you wanna always smell good. Maybe a special occasion, special events, going out to dinner, 
things like that. You're just walking by people, people get a whiff of you, oh, you smell good. You know, everybody like good compliments. And I feel like wearing this bun number nine give you that, you know, that compliment that, that you may need. You know what I'm saying? Your day might not be going good. You pop on some bun number nine, you walk outside, somebody will say, oh, you smell good. And you, that's all you need. Now your day going better. My winter band, obviously, you know, I got to keep this on. I can't take it off. Probably going to tell I'll probably take it off as soon I'm getting in the shower, maybe. This one right here, this is the rubber wet and band, so it sticks to my finger. Can't lose it. And then I have the initials, my wife's name and my name, and the date we were married, so I definitely can't lose this. All right, I'm out. Hope you got to learn a little bit about me. See you next time.